Hello viewers, we are on Sharpneck Competence Days. This is special Sharpneck Competence Days because we are celebrating 30 years of the brand Sharpneck. And today uh, we are together with special guests from Sharpneck. Could you introduce yourself, please? Yes, thank you. Hi, I'm Martin Linau. I'm responsible for LCD displays for large format displays for Europe, working very closely with Japan on uh, the developing the product strategy, but also working with uh, our partners in our market to get the right feedback. Uh, so it, the strategic position is, is really very fascinating. I, I, I should start with a very important question. <laughs> what did you do 30 years ago? 30 years ago, that's 1994. Um, I was still in school. And um, yeah, I was already a, a technology enthusiast, uh, a fan of technology. Um, I remember one of the, the um, yeah, my, my first encounters with technology, uh, hacking my father's passwords, uh, um, yeah, experiencing with the first uh, windows coming one year later. Um, from day one, being uh, an enthusiast about technology and following my father's steps to it, uh, bringing me today through this whole journey and having seen many technology evolutions um, yeah to be here today 30 years later uh, as part of the team defining the strategy for such a an important branch that, that is visualization technologies uh, did you know the brand sharp neck back then 30 years back well yes I I, I knew uh, it, back then it was sharp and uh, NEC so the different brands but yes for sure quality brands some of the products from commercial use but um, yeah the the display technology that NEC has been created uh, or been creating for the last uh, 30 years is impressive and it's it's worth where it brings us today. Uh, it's a track record of having worked with partners and, and users in this in this environment that gives us this experience. Did you imagine to work for this brand? I, I did not. Uh, I'm a, a technology enthusiast, but I never thought that I would then be leading this role and uh, uh, working for such a, uh, a company creating and defining technology. So no, 30 years back, definitely not. But today you are. And mm, first question. What do you think uh, are the most interesting features in large format monitors from Sharpneck? The features that I like most and that customers value um, is the, the quality approach that we take. But also when we launch products, we think of features that benefit that are benefit not only to the end users, but also to the partners installing. So features such as device management, our key are essentials, and, and we do have software for that uh, as well. Um, I think some, some features like the, the vast flexibility and the vast amount of inputs and outputs that we put and design into such a project, into such a, a product that enables the solution, um, such as using latest standards like USB Type-C, um, make it easier for the end user to actually have a very easy uh, day in, in, in conferencing and how they approach meetings. Just walking into a meeting room, being able to connect their own display, their own their laptop to the displays, and, and and straight on being able to to communicate with people uh, and over over internet, over the different uh, conferencing platforms. These values that we use when we create. Um, the, the solution when we think from day one are used and are a benefit for the user, but also for the service. When we create products that are interconnected with other partners' technology, we make it easier for the service people, for uh, them to connect and provide uh, a service to the end user. That this makes it a product that lasts longer. It makes it a product that has a unique value, not only with the features it carries from day one, but at year three, at year five, you still have the same product as the first day if you manage it in the in the right way. I think it's very important you, you mentioned last user. We are talking a lot about last users here during the Sharpening Competence Days with other interviewers. Why do you think it is so important for Sharpneck uh, that you think a lot about the last user also, not only about integrator? Well, it's actually those those are the people using the product every day. Um, if I think of myself as a user of different technology, whenever if I'm making my, uh, preparing myself a coffee or, or if, if I do anything in, in the ordinary day, even in an office, 
I want to use a product that is easy to use, that I can really benefit from it and not having to think, oh, this is very complicated. How can I manage to actually get this technology to run? And the same way I put myself on the other side and say, I want our customers, the end user, to have a benefit of using this product in the best possible way. So when I think of creating the strategy for a product, I always think of myself sitting there, jumping into a meeting and saying, how can I connect easily to talk to Japan, for example, or to talk to anywhere in the world, or even to have a brainstorming session with two colleagues. I want this to be easy. And that is why whenever we create a product strategy, the first thing we do is we ask our partners for feedback. We ask the end user, we ask our service, we ask them what are things that you value, but also what are things that you would criticize, that you would say we need to correct, we need to improve. The world changed, pandemic changed us all. This changed the way we do signage, this changed the way that we uh, interact in meeting rooms. It also changed the way that a control room is set up. All these things translate into a need of the customer, of the end user, the one sitting, touching and using the technology itself. So it's very, very important. And perhaps why you developed the software uh, Navi Set. Could you say anything about this software? Correct, absolutely right. And that's that's exactly, you, you, you hit the spot there. Navi Set enables the partners and the end user to, to keep an overview of the technology they have. Naviset is a software with the purpose of device management, where you can interact with LCD displays, with projectors, with desktop displays, with interactive displays, with LED walls, with all our portfolio, and really read out the status and the health of a display of a projector, know when you need to change uh, uh, the components or service or maintain certain devices, but you can also avoid the end user from the everyday mistakes. The best example is a Friday afternoon, the last person in the meeting room changed some setting. He went home to the weekend. Monday morning, a new person comes into the, the meeting room and the display shows black. And then he calls the IT. IT display in room five is not working. So what happened? He just changed the input. Is that a fault of the display? No, it's just a setting that was that was wrong because a user changed something. With Naviset, for example, what you could do is every Monday morning, you roll out a set of settings, a pair of configurations, a profile to all of the displays you have. And then with just an automated task, you start Monday morning fresh without mistakes. And all these things are covered by Naviset. You can get reports, you can um, be aware of the status and the health of displays or projectors or an LED wall much before a failure happens. Is this uh, the way of developing uh, this technology in the future? If we uh, try to think about the novelistic in the future, you are very young, but uh, if you could imagine what will be in the future for this sector for brand Sharp Neck? So the future will bring exactly this, um, more integration. We have a lot of partners and in, in, in this case I mentioned um, our software that we write in combination with our hardware um, where we know how to create a solution. But there are many other uh, vendors, are many software companies creating solutions such as these. So um, nowadays what we do working together with these technological part uh, partners of the market is to understand their technology, their value proposition, and integrate that either in our firmware, as options, as an SDM board, to working closer together with them. And the key to all this is solution integration. One cannot live without the other. Hardware cannot live without software. Software needs hardware. And this symbiosis, that's the innovation, that's what we are heavily working on to make the full solution much more appropriate and bringing really benefits to the end customer. IT and AV together. Correct, IT, AV, that's the perfect description. Thank you for coming. Thank you for the interview. Thank you for the time. And you viewers, if you want to see more about Sharpneck Competence Days on our channel, Kanawafa YT, remember YouTube. Bye. <laughs>